Welcome future purple pups. So we are excited to meet you. Um, but before we can do that, we need to get you registered for your courses for next year. So on our website, um, which obviously you found because you're watching this video, you will be able to click on a link right here to go to our course registration form that looks like this. To prepare for that, I'd like to point out a course selection worksheet that's just down below our IB Middle Years Program model. So this link right here will take you to a PDF that you can print out if you'd like or just use to sort of make a plan for what classes you want to sign up for in the sixth grade when you start middle school. So Lanier Middle School is part of the IB Middle Years Program and so because of that all students take these eight courses. However, within four of those, you have a little bit of agency. That means that you get to choose an elective that you'd like to fulfill those requirements. So every student is gonna be in math, science, individuals and societies, which is what we call social studies, language and literature, some schools call it English or English language arts. And you'll also be in a class that fulfills language acquisition, physical and health education, arts, and design. To learn more about all of the different options that are listed here in these boxes, uh, you can find more information on the sixth graders page right here. There's a website for you guys called the New Pups website, and that is where you can watch videos and read more about uh, the different electives. So in language acquisition, you can click here, and then it'll take you to this website to tell you more about uh, Spanish, French, and Mandarin, which are the three options that you have. Use this worksheet uh, to guide your choices, and when you're ready, you can find the link to register. It will be live here on uh, May 23rd, and when you click on that, it takes you to a Google form. That Google form is going to ask you for uh, your email address first. Uh, if you are in HISD, uh, please use your school email address, which is S, your S number, at online.houstonisd.org. Then you'll put, put in your last name, your first name, your ID number, which again, if you're in HISD, is gonna be your S number. If you're not in HISD, we need a seven digit number there uh, that starts with a one. So you can just type in one zero 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 zero. But if you are in HISD, please put in your real ID number. Transportation. All students who require transportation for the 2021-2022 school year must indicate their preference below. This is the only way to register for HISD transportation for next school year. So if you need to ride the bus, this is the only way we know about that. Okay, when you get to this section of the form, you're going to uh, refer back to your worksheet. Now you're going to be able to put in your first choice for art, second choice, third choice. Then it's time for language acquisition. You'll do first choice, second choice, third choice. Then it'll be time for your design course. So again, refer back to your worksheet and type in and select your first choice, second choice, third choice, and then refer back to your worksheet for physical and health education. And you'll put in your first, second, and third choice. Oh, sorry, just first and second choice there. Uh, just be aware that there are some conflicts that can't be avoided. Um, some class combinations are impossible, but we'll make every effort to give you your first choice. Um, you have an option here if you want a copy of your responses or not and once you're ready then you'll just click submit and then it'll take you to a screen that looks like this if you do need to edit your response you change your mind or find out you do need to ride the bus you can just click here where it says edit your response and it'll take you right back into your form where you can make whatever changes please don't click on submit another response unless this is for a separate student. Um, each student should only submit this form one time and you can just click on edit your response if you need to make any changes. Thank you so much. We are super excited to meet you in the fall. We will see you at school.